Hi, welcome to Extend Office channel. In this video, you will learn how to set up out of office auto replies in Outlook using different methods. You will get three methods to set up out of office replies in Outlook on Windows. Know how to set up out of office replies in Outlook on Mac as well as on the web in this video. Let's start with the first topic, set up out of office replies in Outlook on Windows. This section demonstrates three methods to help you set up out of office replies for Exchange accounts and all email accounts on Windows. If you are using an Exchange account in Outlook, the built-in automatic replies feature can help you set up out of office replies. In your Outlook, go to the File tab. Select the Exchange account for which you need to enable auto reply from the account drop-down list. And then click Automatic replies. If you don't see this automatic replies option, your email account does not support this feature, you can try any of the following methods. In the opening automatic replies window, you need to do as follows. Select the send automatic replies option to enable this feature. If you want to send the automatic replies only within a specified time range, check the only send during this time range checkbox and specify the desired start and end times. To send automatic replies to the senders inside your organization, stay in the Inside My Organization tab, and then type in the auto reply message in the text box. If you also want to send automatic replies to the senders outside your organization, click the Outside My Organization tab. Check the auto reply to people outside my organization checkbox, choose an option you need and then type in the auto reply message. It should be noted that if both the Inside My Organization and the Outside My Organization options are configured, they will be active at the same time. You can also specify rules for sending auto replies if you need. In the lower left corner of the window, click the Rules button. In the Automatic Reply Rules dialog box, click the Add Rule button, and then specify the criteria for your rule. In this example, I want to send automatic replies to all incoming emails without applying filters using a rule, so I just close these dialog boxes and clear the only send during this time range checkbox because I need to activate the automatic replies immediately. If you set a time period for automatic replies, the auto reply will activate at the designated time. Finally click the OK button to save the settings. Automatic replies in your specified exchange account is now activated and you will see a yellow information bar showing below the Outlook ribbon. To turn off this feature, simply click the Turn Off button in the information bar. This is how we set up out of office auto replies in Outlook Exchange account. Here I would like to recommend you the auto reply feature of KuTools for Outlook, which helps you set up out of office replies easily in Outlook, regardless of the email account types. After downloading and installing KuTools for Outlook, select the KuTools tab on Outlook ribbon. Select Reply, Auto Reply Manager to open the Auto Reply dialog box. In this dialog box, check email accounts where you want to enable automatic reply. Modify the subject prefix for automatic reply emails. The default text in the subject prefix text box is Auto Response. This will be the prefix for auto reply email subjects. You can replace this default text as needed. Then enter the auto reply content. A default template is provided in the dialog box, which you can modify as needed. And finally click OK to save the changes. A KuTools for Outlook dialog box pops up asking if you want to activate the feature immediately. Click the Yes button to enable the feature. The auto reply feature of KuTools for Outlook is now activate. From now on, Incoming emails to the checked accounts will trigger automatic replies. You also can create Outlook rules to set up out of office replies for all email accounts. However, this method requires multiple steps to complete. If you need, follow the steps below. First you need to create an automatic reply template. Click New Email under the Home tab to create a new email message. In the message window, enter a subject and the message body for this template. Select the File tab. Save As. In the opening Save As dialog box, select Outlook template from the Save As Type drop-down list and then click the Save button. 
After saving the template, close the email without saving. You will then need to create an out of office auto reply rule with this template. Under the home tab, click rules, manage rules and alerts to open the rules and alerts window. In the rules and alerts window and under the email rules tab, specify an email account where you want to apply the auto reply rule. If this drop down list does not display in the rules alerts window of your Outlook, the rules you created will apply to all email accounts. And then you need to click the new rule button. In the first rules wizard, select apply rule on messages I receive in the start from a blank rule section, and then click the next button. In the second rules wizard, if you want to automatically reply to every email message you receive, click the next button without checking any conditions. If you only want to automatically reply to certain emails, specify the conditions you need. In this example, I directly click the next button without specifying any conditions and click the yes button in the popping up dialog box. In the third rules wizard, check the reply using a specific template checkbox and then click the underlined text. In the opening dialog box, choose user templates in file system from the look in drop down list. Select the template you created before and then click the open button. When it returns to the third rules wizard, you can see the path of the template is displayed in the step 2 box, click the next button to go ahead. In the fourth rules wizard, specify exceptions for your rule if necessary. Here I click the next button without checking any exceptions. In the last rules wizard, specify a name for this rule in the step 1 section. Keep the turn on this rule box checked in step 2. And then click the finish button. A Microsoft Outlook prompt box will then pop up reminding you that the rule will only run when Outlook is running. Click the OK button. Then it returns to the rules and alerts window. Click the OK button to save the rule. Now you have created an auto reply rule in Outlook. From now on, incoming emails to the specified account or all accounts will trigger this auto reply rule and the person who sent you an email will receive an auto reply email. Now we have completed the three methods to set up out of office replies in Outlook on Windows. Let's move on to the second part, setting up out of office auto replies in Outlook on Mac. In Outlook on Mac, go to the Tools tab. Select out of office. In the automatic replies dialog box. First you need to select the email account for which you want to enable out of office. Check the send automatic replies for account checkbox. In the reply wants to senders within my organization, enter the body for the automatic reply message. If you want to set the start and end dates for the automatic reply, check the send replies only during this time period checkbox and enter the start and end dates and times. You can also reply to people outside your organization Check the send replies outside my organization checkbox. Choose the option you need and then enter the body for the automatic reply message. Then click OK to save the settings and apply this automatic replies feature. Auto replies have been enabled for certain email accounts in your Outlook for Mac. From now on, incoming emails to this account will trigger automatic replies. To turn off the automatic replies, open the automatic replies window, select the email account for which automatic replies have been enabled, clear the send automatoc replies for account checkbox, and then click the OK button. The last part of the video will demonstrate how to set up out of office auto replies in Outlook on web. On the upper right corner of the page, click the settings button. In the opening settings window, select automatic replies in the mail section. Click the turn on automatic replies toggle to turn on the automatic replies feature. Check the send replies only during a time period checkbox and specify the start and end dates for the automatic replies. If you specify start and end dates for sending automatic replies, you can choose to minimize interruptions during that period, such as blocking your calendar, automatically declining new event invitations, and canceling or declining your existing meetings.
You can ignore this time period setting if you want to enable the automatic replies immediately. In the text edit box, enter the body for the automatic reply message. If you want to automatically reply to your contacts only, check the send replies only to contacts checkbox. If you are using an exchange account, the page displayed will be different. You can send automatic reply emails not only to the senders inside your organization, but also to the senders outside your organization. When the settings are complete, click the save button to save the settings. Then close the settings window. Now you have enabled auto replies in Outlook on the web. From now on, incoming emails to this account will trigger automatic replies. To turn off this automatic replies feature in Outlook on the web, follow the previous steps to get into the automatic replies window, click the automatic replies on toggle, and then click the save button. This is the end of the video. Thanks for watching.